I, uh, <laughs> I have no, I have no preferences. Oh, really? I have to say, you know, the t the team who who managed to go to the final always deserve to go there. So really, but I think you can, as as everybody was telling me, you can you can see it coming. So we will see what will happen at Stamford Bridge. But uh, you know, I think it would be a remarkable. Uh, end of career if I if I play European final against my uh, fitting end team. fitting end for you I just want to say congratulations brilliant Thank you. Um, just how difficult has it been for you now that you're not the number one to prepare for such really a big game as it was tonight you had to train extra hard for this well I think uh, you know with all my experience I uh, I can't compensate the, the much uh, rhythm or less Match rhythm with uh, you know the way I know how to prepare, and uh, I, for, throughout my career the the key for me was always the preparation and training. So I always go 100 percent every training, every moment, and literally I prepare the same way for every game, whether it's a friendly game or game I know I will start on the bench. There is no difference in my preparation. A bit you know I give everything to because I always believe you have to be ready no matter what when you come on or, or, or not. And that's the key. So I feel uh, I feel always confident that you know I'm ready to play, and and as well, the, the obviously the the experience helps. You wouldn't but, know that you've been out, you know, watching you that you haven't been playing regularly. Did you find time to actually enjoy it out there tonight? Well, I enjoyed uh, when we scored the fourth one. This is yes. the first moment where I enjoyed because uh, <laughs> you know you you never know. I, and I'm always you know I'm kind of always I never celebrate. I always go through from the from the first to final whistle and. But then, you know, when we scored the third and then fourth, you know, then that was the moment where I thought, OK, we, we are in. We are in. Petr, you're 37 in May. You're not particularly old for a goalkeeper to retire. They normally go on a bit longer. Is that you definitely out? Or can you just be enticed? Is there, would a particular club just make you think about your retirement? Well, uh, you know, you have days when you, when, you know, you... You play well, you come home and you kind of think, well, you know, should you should you continue or not? But no, I think the decision I made with a uh, with lot of thought and and, you know, everybody is telling me that uh, that I'm, uh, I'm a bit crazy to retire now. But uh, I, I know that I could possibly go another two years, but I prefer to retire two years early than one year too late. So, you know, I, I decided to retire on my own terms. Rather than wait when uh, when I break and then I will have to say okay I'm old I have to finish so no that's 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 it and you know my dream the last dream was to to play this European final with Arsenal and you know that dream come true now so obviously the last step is to win it because every final is there to win and well I hope you win it for your sake yeah. I really how, do how different does this feel you've played in big games you've played in finals before you've won trophies before you now know you will play one more game in your career and that is it the it's best a huge game, game as well. It's the best game. Really? Is that how it feels? You know, it's the it's the worst game when you play it because you have so much, you know, pressure from everywhere and on yourself. But it's the best game to play. You know, you as a, as a little boy, you dream to be in a European final. You watch the TV, and that's probably the reason why you go to train every yeah. day. And and actually, I have to say that's the reason why I go to train every day because I want to reach finals. I want to play big games. I want to. Uh, you know, I want to be there with the trophy, no matter how hard and how stressful and uh, how it is. But uh, this is why you play football. So, so what? What are you doing to make sure that you really savor this and make the most of this? Because this isn't like, oh, I might win this one and then I'll go again next year. That does, that's not going to happen for the first time in your career. This is it. I think you know the key is to play your game. Because when you go to the final, you actually arrived because you play your game. You play your best game. And, and people always think, oh, you, have, you know, come to the final, you have to do something special. No, you play your best game. And if everybody plays the best game, you have a best chance to, to win it. If the best game is that you defend in your box for 90 minutes, you know, that's it. Mm -hmm. if, you, if your best game is to win 3-0, you win 3-0. But, but you generally, you know, in the final, you need to keep calm, be, be brave and play your best game. That's, that's literally what you have to do. But are you, are you sort of blocking out the fact that there's no more football after this? Are you trying to ignore it so you can just focus on the performance? How are you playing it mentally? Well, you know, I kind of feel like that is uh, it's never ending. But, uh, but I, I think that the, during the last game or after the last game, maybe just before the last game, I will feel uh, a different quiet emotion moment, because a quiet moment to root. But to I to, you know, I have to say, we we, we, lo we lost the first game away uh, in in Borisov, and and you play at home, 
it could have been the last game. Then we lost 3-1 in France and you think, OK, this could be the last game. Then you go to, to, to Napoli when you know they are so strong at home and, and uh, you know, the, the score 2-0 is it's to your favour, but it's not so hard to, you so know, you, as, as we had seen this week, it's not so hard to, to lose. So that could have been the... So basically every single round I, I go see. and said, oh, this could be the last game. So This is I'm, your I'm life glad, now, to live as if it's your I'm, last game. I'm glad that there is three more weeks. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, the plan when it's finally done, relax, eat any food you like, not go in the gym, have a holiday? Uh, well, I have to say I, uh, I keep the door open for uh, whatever comes. And, you know, staying home, doing nothing, playing ice hockey, playing drums, or doing something in football straight away is always a possibility. I will just sit uh, at home and, and I will see what, what will come. But now, uh, really, I concentrate on on this, exactly on this last week's final. I we need win you it. to be focused. I, I want to win it. That's, exactly. that's all I, mean, I want. And there's so. a job to do for the keep. There's, he's playing for the team. He's one member of the team, despite what's happening at the end of his career. It's been a fantastic career, I have to say. And it's a perfect way to finish it, isn't it? To walk away Absolutely. with a trophy. Well, you know. Let's do it. This, he still I, thinks I, I always say the, the final. No, I always say the final is there to win, nothing else. Yeah. You know, in a history, in 10 years, nobody remembers who who you beat, only the one who won. So, you know, you have to be on the winning side. Good man. And a final mention for those fans up there. Listen, they've seen some uh, some dodgy away performances in recent times. Over 2,000 of them came out here this evening. They were in fine voice throughout, weren't they? No, I think our away fans have been brilliant throughout the whole season. Obviously, in the in the Premier League, we, we didn't make them happy recently. But, uh, you know, in, in, the, in the European games in the last two games I think we made them proud so I think it, this is obviously for uh, all the fans and everybody uh, involved in all connected to Arsenal Football Club because you know this is a this is a big moment for the club as well one game left it could end with you holding a trophy aloft very best of luck thank you thanks for coming out and joining us see Peter. you at the final all the best you guys good man take care thank you very much right we'll let